Hi. We get an internet. I just stopped and started the video. I wasn't doing anything else. So I think what I want to do. So if I wait until Saturday, I think I can still find stables on Saturday. First off, let's pick up that so I don't get confused. It's closed. Yeah, 6 a.m. Wait till dawn. Plus an hour. Need a ride. Yeah, it just goes to Harmondale. Damn it. Boat go anywhere? Like to not Harmondale? Well, it can't go to Harmondale, but to Avley. Okay. That doesn't help either. Oh. <clears throat> Poopy. I don't want to go to either of those spots. I can walk to Harmondale, I can walk to Avley, I can walk to Dea. And those are my options. I am too early for Dea in my mind. Figures I could have gone stagecoach to Dea or let's see Tularian boat. No, oh, it would have been closed yesterday. Okay, so this doesn't really get me anywhere. I can go to the Evermorn Island in seven days, but there's no reason for me to go to the Evermorn Island. I guess Avli. I mean, Day is kind of a crappy place. I don't have quests for either of those areas, do I? Barrows. I mean that. Technically, there's something in Avli, but it's going to be a while before I do it. and It's not the promotion quest I want to do right now, anyway. Barrow down, barrow down. Maybe I should just go to the damn barrow downs already. I hate that place so much. I do have a quest in Avli. Let's go to Avli. Welcome aboard! Is the anchor that glitch. Anyway. Day is... Tuesday. Where do you end up going? Just out of curiosity. To Arathia. That's good to know, because Arathia is kind of where I probably should have gone to begin with. Can I buy the damn plate mat, plate skill yet? That would be nice. So this is Avli. Once more, all the trees are dead. Don't know why. But first... Welcome, travelers. I didn't even look at the objectives. Dang it. Well, it looks like it's probably a hundred tower. So this is a setup where it'd be a lot easier to just take out their tower, I think. But I'm gonna thief first so I can steal their stuff. Because they had a much better draw than I did. So you notice our whatchamacallit, um uh, resource upkeeps are really low. Man, I hope I'm doing an okay job explaining Archimage because it how far in advance I'm doing this, it doesn't exactly help me. So I can't, you know, ask, how am I doing on the explanation? Nope, can't do that. Also, I meant to check to see if I was clipping, and I didn't. I'm doing great. Oof. I guess I'm going to increase my wall. I'm going to play a cheap one first. Oof. I'm not doing so great. Dang it. And the stupid lodestone. Mm, no. Quarry. I'm thinking I'm gonna end up going for a resource victory at this rate. Mm. Now let's go ahead and increase Zoo a little bit. I can afford the time. Uh, get rid of that. It's useless. Um, you don't need that much quarry. Um, it's worth playing it for one. 
and damage enemy tower some. Um, no. Sure. Trying to get my brick accumulation because I think it might be a hundred, and if so, I'm gonna win next turn. It's not a hundred. It's either 150 or 200. Great. Um, werewolf. Ah, nearly tied on everything, and almost everything is going to cost me brick. Bah! Not 125. Just do damage. Build up tower. It's not 150, it must be 200. At this rate, I might just be going for tower victory now. Oof. I got darkened. Alright, stop attacking my bricks. It must be 200 bricks. Which means I'm not too far off, luckily. Crystallize up my tower some. It might not even be a 100 tower. Wow. Um, go away. Okay, if it's 200, I win. Ah, uh, is it 250? Darn, I really should have looked up the rules first. Uh-oh, that's not a good sign. Oh, I'm gonna eat some of your beasts. So I just heard the deck shuffle. Not a hundred tower either. Hmm. Let's actually do some damage. I win if it's 250. Are you kidding me? Arg! Screw it. I'm gonna spend some. Losing the brick game now. Never going to be able to play that. Corey's up at 11 now, jeez. Well, that's gonna help me a little bit. <sighs> it might be 120, and if so, that will win. It's 120 or 125. What was it, anyway? 350 resources and 125 tower. Ah, uh, well. Oh, now I know. And I won, anyway. Doesn't matter. All right, where are you? One, a two. -hoo. I don't know why they hide the third one usually. A three, chomp. A three. Speaking of, where are you going? Clearing forest. No, I don't need a ride. 
I don't know what that well does. You, perception expert. I don't even have the skill anywhere. Spear expert. I also don't have the skill. Maybe I should have used the spears this time. ID monster master, which I'm not even close to ready for. Arms master master. That's a mouthful. Out in the heel full for the high level one. Water resistance. So this is just the temple. How may we help you? Walk in the light. Goodbye. Body resistance. Get me banned on Twitch. Axe expert. What do you do? Plus two endurance. Sweet. Please tell me I can actually buy the damn armor. Well, I mean, this is weapon shop, but still. Hmm, Kamasupa. Actually, fairly nice. Weapons. Please tell me I can get plate mail. Oh, thank the gods. Okay. Now that you're not wearing garbage. I know I'm going to get garbage prices for all of this. The elves aren't exactly my friends right now. But I need to sell stuff so I have inventory space. And money, you know. Money's helpful. Alright, what do you have for sale? Antique resplendent chain mail. It only costs 30 grand. 35 grand if I go there. Um, some Regnant Armor. Regnant Armor, Enchantable Armor. Earth Resistance. Full Helm. More Grid Gauntlets of the Fist. And Dragon Gauntlets of Plenty. Ooh. I can't even come close to affording that, though. I'm gonna need another 3,000 gold. I would love to buy that right now. I don't think that's gonna happen anytime soon. Oh, I do have a lot of gemstones. I might be able to pull this off. I really hope so, because I can really use some MP regen right now. Alright, where is your magic item shop? Those are guilds. Magic item shop is probably out somewhere. Oh, please tell me you actually have a magic item shop. I didn't think there was a place without one. Warrior Mage. So this is the Archer promotion quest. <laughs> so you think you can become Warrior Mages, do you? It isn't easy. You must be equally proficient in magical skills and physical skills. There's a test of this. Visit the Red Dwarf Mines. And yes, this is totally a Red Dwarf reference. Inside, you will find two kinds of beasts. One that can only be harmed by magic, one that can only be harmed with steel. In the back of the lower section of the mines, you will find a machine created by the dwarves that powers a lift. The only access between the upper and lower sections of the mines. To keep the creatures trapped in the lower section, you will have to replace the belt in the machine with this one. A worn belt that should only last about an hour before breaking. This should give you enough time to get to the lift and get out before you are trapped down there. Seal away these creatures and return to me. Only then will I call you warrior mages. So that's the archer promotion quest. Staff Grandmaster? Why? <laughs> Uh, body Guild, Water Magic Expert, also I'm going to actually grab that like I meant to. Your Mind Magic Master? Yeah, definitely not ready for that. Oh, I'm not seeing a magic item seller. This is not good, this is bad. I have enough money if I could only sell stuff. Because you're a bank. Gold is safe with us. 
and I'm not seeing any magic item seller. Boop. Air Magic Master. Gale is the Grand Master in Bricadia Desert, because everything is full in Bricadia Desert. Infernian, who buys Enrothian wine and sells glass bottles. Chainmaster is here. Which is nice, except that... Oh, God damn it. I have enough stuff to be able to sell. If only I could actually sell things. I could try stealing. I don't think I can be able to steal it, but, you know, I haven't tried stealing before. I assume I... I assume I got caught stealing. Well, I never. You are banned from the shop. That's the negative effect of stealing. Well, one of many. Just gonna try a couple more times. I think that's just not going to be within reach. Nope, I'm not going to be able to pull that off. Damn it! All because I can't find a magic item shop! Grrr. So many gurs. So, so many gurs. I've already talked to you, yeah. Evely is such a hole. Anyway, we have a quest here. I might as well go to it. Who knows, maybe I will actually finish the quest off and get money and... This quest is actually fairly easy. It's a puzzle quest. Lots of guards here for no reason. I never understood why there's just guards hanging around in this section. Where we want to go is actually over here. This is the hall under the hill. Let's start casting our spells. I'm even going to recast Wizard Eye because I can. It doesn't look like much, but getting in isn't easy. Careful not to stray from the path. So this is the hall under the hill. It doesn't look too bad in here. See? All under the hill. That's it. It's the entire dungeon. No, it isn't, because we teleport. That's the trick, is that you need to keep going around until you find the entrance. The little king bows. Welcome to my realm, mortals. Few attain the door, and for that I commend thee. But now you stand at the threshold of fairy. Know that few return. Few, ah, few return that dare to enter. Yo, Johan won't be wanting the fairy pipes, eh? Can't say I'm surprised. You want to come here himself, the coward. The pipes will cost you, though. All of your food. Of course, I've got some delightful food down below, should they be wanting to stock your packs. And more musical instruments. And we are out of food now. So, technically, we can just walk out right now. That was the entire quest. But I want loot. Oh, dang it. I forgot that that was where I needed to go. And there's no way back up. Oh, oh, yeah, there is. That just teleports me. So. Let's just go around the hill. It doesn't matter what direction you go around, by the way, as long as you do so. This is what I wanted to do. Ow, what a Are you freaking kidding me? This is what I wanted. The fairy ring is always here. Hmm. ID monster skill, which I actually have. 
Healing potion. Garbage. 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 Money. Heal you up. You're now wearing that belt. And where did my ring go? There's my ring. And now you can recast Wizard Eye at 8th level. Nice. Okay, and you can cast Feather Fall so I can actually land. There we go. See, that was the whole reason why I wanted to come here, was the ring. I mean, I want loot as well. There's dragonflies in here. Lots of dragonflies, because this game doesn't have one dragonfly. It has like 50 bajillion dragonflies for everything. Luckily, regen will actually take care of my healing at this point. Queen Dragonfly? Queen Dragonfly. Uh oh. They still don't have that many hit points. They just actually have AC. I get hit so often because of my low AC. Maybe Anya Selving was not the greatest of ideas for my first relic. Oh well. I found a key, but more importantly, I have money. This is worthless. Chainmail is loot. A piece of junk. That's not junk. Some may call this junk. Others call it treasure. Anyway, we have fruit trees here. And I'm not going to bother eating the apples yet. There's not much of a reason for me to. Hmm. Alright, next area. So if this dungeon looks a little familiar, that's because it should look familiar. It's very similar to a dungeon that was in Might Magic 6. Where everything looked natural and so on. Uh, that would have been uh, one of the Druid Quest ones, but anyway. It's very similar. Hmm. Buckle Ox. sure I grab all the fruit trees because I'm gonna need food just, I'm gonna buy more food when I'm in Athlete again but I'm gonna need food hidden doors for loot hmm. meh what a piece of junk. Yeah, this loot's kind of boring. Is this hide any better? Some valuable stuff that I can't sell here. What a piece of junk. Uh, that's not good, but mm. not terrible at least. So many mosquitoes. I mean dragonflies. So I actually looked up the graphics thing. I actually have this set for the fancy graphics. Apparently, what I'm used to is the not-so-fancy graphics. Remember there was something weird about this room. What was it? I found my fourth club. Aw, oh, yeah. So does everybody already have clubs? They do. I actually get to sell a club. There's something weird about this room. What was it? I remember, there's something bizarre. I want to say that this opens up and it's triggered by like a keyhole someplace weird. Who has the key anyway? So I know I picked it up. I saw that I picked it up. 
there's a key. My kingdom for actually having my perception skill. Maybe it was on the outside of this little area. This is the type of place that I've been through several dozen times having this problem. This is not unique to this run. I always have problems finding what I need to find in here. That's why I'm looking at the edges, trying to spot one that's out of place. I even still hear dragonflies, and I can see that I'm in yellow, so I know there's more to this dungeon, uh, if only because of the treasure room. What was it? Was it out here, maybe? I don't think it was. Arg, I always forget where things are in this dungeon. Southwest corner. Southwest. Search the north wall. Um, um, <sighs> continue and kill the dragonfly in the structure to take more items. Go to the southwest corner and search the north wall for a hidden keyhole. This is the southwest corner. Let's see, maybe the person doesn't know east from west. Let's try to look at the southeast corner. I am not seeing a damn keyhole. I know it's something dumb. I've done this many times and forgotten each and every one of these times. If I had the perception skill, it would actually be highlighted right now, but I don't. Let's try searching elsewhere. Hold on. Cap lock enabled. Do, 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 do. Click on tile to reveal a hole. This is one of those where I have to click on a specific tile. God damn it! because I don't have boots on most of my characters still. Hey, boots. And trap. Oops. This is worthless. No, it isn't. Sorry. That's worth a lot of money. I will make room for you. 
This is worthless. Hmm. Sorry, no room. How far in negatives are you? Negative five, and you have no uh, regen already went down. Just regen yourself. This was actually a promotion quest. I didn't pick up the promotion quest? Oh. I'm going to scream. All right. Um, yeah, that's a thing. I mean, this was a part of the Hunter promotion quest, and I thought I had it, but apparently not. Grumble, 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 toil in trouble, cauldron burn and fire bubble. Okay. Now I'm going to buy those damn gauntlets. That's why I'm running. Running as fast as I can to there before it closes or something dumb like that. About damn time. I uh, don't know who to actually give it to. I'm going to give it to the clerk for the time being. Actually, I think you need those. No. Yeah, you really don't need more accuracy. What do you have equipped? Yeah, so this is now cell bait. There's no space. <sighs> Fine elfish weapons. Thank you for your patronage. And the armor disappeared. Okay. Whatever. I think it just went into her inventory. Okay. Find elfish weapons. Thank you for your coming. How may I help? Well, I at least have a little bit of money. Yeah, plus one luck isn't worth wearing. Okay. I can level up. So I've heard worse ideas. No. I've heard worse ideas, but I'm going to go exploring first. And also get some food, because otherwise bad things are going to happen. Welcome, traveler. Our meals are second, second to none. none. Our meals are second to none. Alright. So... Darn it, I keep hitting the spell button. Let us go south. This is a dangerous place, by the way. There are a lot of very powerful enemies here. Which is why I'm going to go mess around with them. So, Avli, east of the Tularian Forest. So, east is Tularian Forest. I don't particularly need or want to go east. Got the weird road again. And then... Wyverns! Remember those things that kicked my ass? Yeah. That's the normal enemy here. Mm, tasty. There's good stuff over here, but it takes a lot of effort for me to fill, kill anything. Horned Wyvern. I can kill it. Uh, my kingdom for... Useful spells. This won't stop me. Yeah, just look at how much damage that just dealt to me.
I'm gonna die. Yeah. I am gonna die. Do, 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 do. Run away! Ow! What a scratch! Before I die from other reasons. Okay, I do still have regen up on her, not on anybody else. I'm actually letting them come closer, by the way, because I want the guards to fight him. the one I injured. I there. Do I actually have any good ranged bells right now? Eh. It'll do. Naturally, I miss with Anya selfing. They're magic resistant, aren't they? That should be doing more than 10 damage. Why do I keep missing with Anya? I don't know. I don't know what it is. Darn it, I'm too low to the ground now. Okay, at least I killed the damn horn quivering. There's a possibility I'll be dead soon. So yeah. Right, magic seven. I'm not gonna make it. Yes, you are. I just healed the damn wyvern. <laughs> so things are going well. They do a lot of damage. Luckily there's a lot of guards here. That's the reason why there's so many guards around. By the way, I'm just going to be very careful about what I attack. I don't remember if I get XP for the killing blow or not. So what I'm going to do is take a look at my current XP. 3706. Thirty-seven seven oh six. Yeah, I only get XP if I'm the one that does the killing blow. Great. It's not what I wanted at all. So I don't get XP for those kills. How did you die after whatever? Okay. Well, at least I get to loot some things. It's money did need money. I'm just going to go train. I can maybe I should just remove the expert run tag off of this. Um, no, train here. Practice makes perfect. Well done. Well done. Well, I learned stuff. Also, I need money. <clears throat> so, I am going to learn plate expert. Because plate is going to be a skill I'm going to have lots of interest in. 
Oh, I would really like to be able to expert arms master already, but I'm in the wrong place for that. Um, go up to learning four. Mm, boopy. Dunno. I need spirit magic. I mean, I'm gonna have to go up to leather four at some point, but some point is not today. Where's the other horseshoe? There we go. Fire four. There we go. Okay. I'm starting to get up there, but oh, this is so slow. So where can I travel to today? Let's find out. Can I go to some place not stupid? Oh, yeah, that's right. I could have boated to Arathia, couldn't I? Uh, maybe I should actually reload and do that. Dea, no. Dea is not the type of place I should be going to right now. Although outdoors, I should be okay. Indoors, I'm utterly screwed. Mm, no, actually, I take that back. Outdoors, I'm also screwed. Let's just travel. Ow! What a scratch. That's not the save I was expecting it to be. Okay. Screw it. Oops. I didn't mean to reload the save again. Um Do I have the good Yes, okay, good. That's the important part. I'm just going to boat. <laughs> this is ridiculous, I know. I'm also going to buy some food. But I need to go to Arathia. And I'm not even at time yet. Let's grab some food. Welcome, travelers. My meals are second to none. I have 119 fame. I'm famous, ma! Darlene the Herbalist. Hey there. You do alchemy bonus, yeah. Alchemy bonus is actually nice if you have a druid heavy party. And by druid heavy, I mean having a druid. That's even glitching even more. Anyway, welcome to Arathia. There's griffins that live here, by the way. Don't piss off the griffins. We're going to piss off the griffins eventually, by the way. There's also raiders. Raiders are guards. And this is the design of the humans. They're Greetings. interesting, I guess. Yeah, it gives a bonus to Arms Master, which is very nice for a might-based party, by the way. This is the day of the God's Pedestal. See, they do exist. They're just in rare Greetings. locations. Take care. And those are the same as in Might Magic 6. And this is the Cavalier Promotion Quest. The hallmark of the Cavalier is courage. Before I promote you to Cavalier status, or I can promote you to Cavalier status, before you'll do that, you'll have to prove your bravery in battle. Since most people are yellow helly cow. I can't read today. Yellow bellied cowards at heart. I doubt you'll succeed. But if you want to try, here's what you must do destroy all the undead in the haunted mansion in the Barrow Downs. That's the reason why I didn't want to go to the Barrow Downs yet, because I have a knight in my party. I should definitely do that quest. The other side is Crusader. Hail! I am Sir Charles Quixote. I am the humble champion of the people, and I am at thy service. Ha! So thee wishes to take the test to be a crusader? I cannot blame thee. The sense of pride one feels when one has accomplished a heroic deed is sublime. The test is simple. A dragon must be slain. I know just the one. Womthrax the Heartless. He lives in a cave in Tatalia and terrorizes the peasants who live near him when he's home. He should be in the cave this time of year. Because this is probably thine first dragon, I will travel with thee to give thee pointers. So let us f go forthwith and spill this monster's black blood. So yeah, literally one. Slaying a dragon is now the first promotion quest instead of the second, because this game hates paladins. And two, Don Quixote, I mean Charles Quixote, is now in your party. He does nothing, by the way. But first, come in, come in. let us play Archimage. All right, tower 20, wall 5. I need to get to tower 50 or resource 150. Okay.
Get a corn. Definitely need to increase zoo. Uh, <laughs> it's, very... it's a very thematic game in my mind. I need to get up to eight more tower and then I win. Just need to increase tower bar. I only need to increase tower. Screw it. Get some wall. Just need more tower. Damn it, game. There. It's not so hard. Okay. Let's continue on. This is town hall area. This also gives temporary might, which yes please. Instead of a town hall. Bounty hunts up Minotaur. Anyway. Mona the Prelate. Four point bonus to self spells. That's a new NPC here. Trading. Here is the actual leveling up place, which I will hit later. Need a new Queen's Forge. I can learn Axe here. Maybe I should go with Axe. I don't know. What do you all think? What skill should I end up having my Knigget to use? Probably not axe because axes are not good in this game. Because that means you have to be a ranger to use it properly, and rangers are terrible. Um, Dragon hide gauntlets, unenchanted. Same with silver mesh gauntlets. I don't really need unenchanted things right now. Master skill plus one. Those are garbage. A one, a two, a three, chomp, three. Yeah, some of these wells, I'm really not sure what they do. Today? So I can leave to the Bricadia Desert from here or back to Harmondale. That's good to know. So this is the city of Stedwick. Arathia is the name of the country. So you're the ones at Lord Markham's estate? How do you like your winnings so far? Had enough winning? If I were you, I'd give him a piece of your mind. His mansion's in Tatalia near the wharf. Tatalia's a garbage place, by the way. So everybody can only use the might well, uh, the stat wells once. Body guild membership. And your spirit guild membership, yeah. Watch your wallet when you're around here, my friends. Steadwick abounds in thieves. As a matter of fact, we are the world capital of thieves. It's common knowledge that Bill Lasker, the master thief, lives in the sewers beneath Steadwick. Yep, yet another game where the master thief lives in the sewers. Mind magic expert. I didn't throw any points into mind magic. Nope, that was foolish of me. Pocket fairy. I'm already body magic expert. You buy griffin feathers and sell arrowheads. Maybe I'll actually figure out the damn trading system. Ah. So you are the lords of Harmondale, eh? You don't look like much. We shall see if history judges you. Or how history judges you. I myself am a historian and collector of rare historical items. Lord Markham also collects such items of interest. And there is one item in particular that would complete my collection. Parshan's Quill. The quill used to sign the Treaty of Pierpoint, ending the First Timber War. 
I know you have dealt with Lord Markham before. It's how you became lords of this land, after all. And if you were to deliver this letter to Lord Markham and Titalia, I'm sure he would respond favorably. I would even, I would be even more in your debt if Lord Markham sends the item back with you. I would be sure to favorably record your heroic acts and deeds. So basically, you need to get a letter from, uh, you need to get a quill from Lord Markham, which he's actually happy to give. Promise, Lord Markham's a dick. All right, so this is the Archimage Champion quest. So, to be declared Archimage Champion, you must win the game of Archimage in every tavern on, in, and under the continent of Arathia. There's 13 total, and some of them are in some really nasty places. We've completed, what, four? Four. Mace Expert. I don't think I even threw points in Mace, did I? No. Because why would I? Anyway, continuing on. Hello, Griffin. There's actually a quest to kill the Griffins of this place. And, hey, look, the ruling family is known as Griffinheart. How are you? Uh, yeah, you don't care about most of this. Can you I do, help though. You with anything? Such terrible prices for everything. I actually have money. Just couldn't find a place to sell the garbage. Ah, screw it. Thanks. Come again. Wrong character. This is also the place where you can use the ore at. So that'll be nice. I'm at 51 minutes. Okay, I've got time. Can I help you with anything? Uh, display inventory. Also, I should actually see if there's anything I want here. Uh, cheap amulet. Silver mesh gauntlets of magic. Plus 5 MP is not a bad idea. ID monster skill plus 3. Don't really need that too much. Hardened item. This is one of the best potions to make in the game. Um, this actually makes items less likely to break. They actually added it. And you can tell from looking at the potion, it's a combination of a green and yellow potion. It's a layered potion. So layered potions require expert rank, which I can actually get, which is nice. Less potions, similar concept. Thanks. Come, Come again. again. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, it's a sailor. Sage. What was the sage doing anyway? I don't remember now. Hi. Oh, ID item and ID monster. No. Alright, I can't really go see Queen the Queen yet because reasons. The guild of the body will Oh, I should have saved first before coming in. Cure disease. Uh, regen. Hammer hands. Yeah, these are not useful. This is the Paramount Guild of Spirit. They're the ones that have the great googly moogly spirit. So, heroism, yay! The Guild of the Spirit welcomes you. It's so expensive, but yeah, I need to buy it. Fate, turn undead, detect life. I might as well pick up turn undead. I'm actually going to need it soon. Um, spirit Lash is one of the better melee spells in the game. The problem is it has to be melee range. It literally does not work outside of melee range, so it's not that great. Resurrection is, in fact, the Grand Master spell of Spirit, just like it was the last spell in Night Magic 6. Heroism's nice, but it requires expert skill, and I don't have that yet. Uh, maybe I should actually pick up some of these. Yeah, I've got the money. I'll pick up those two. I'll hold off on preservation because I don't really need it right now. The Guild of the Mind welcomes you. Berserk is a fun spell. Basically, it makes a creature target anything nearby them. And it actually works. The Satisfact spells in Might Magic 7 work properly. Berserk, Berserk, Charm. Charm and Berserk are very similar to each other. Main difference is Charm stops it from attacking, Berserk makes it attack everybody. And Charm costs half as much. 
Oh, yeah, I should pick up Cure Paralysis. Oh, sure, why not? I'm spending all my money anyway. What difference does it make? Anyway, if you can't tell, Stedwick is a city of the haves versus the have-nots. Because, of course, it is. Everything in this game is. I learned it. I can't wait to use this. Yeah, these can't be used yet, so they're just moving off to a different character. Oops, wrong side. You are an NPC. Roberta Theban. I want to say she's actually a target for a quest. Raytheon is sure a better place now that Catherine is ruling from Castle Griffinheart, don't you think? So Ka uh, Catherine Griffinheart is the wife of King Roland from Might Magic 6. And this game. Um, she, in the um, information from Might Magic 6, she was called to come back. And what actually happened, and this is part of Heroes of Might Magic 3, is that her father was assassinated, then turned into a lich and started trying to invade everybody. So Catherine went in and went all conquer, conquer on everybody. Just moment, let me check. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Oh, it's still Alice Hargraves. She's still the fairest of them all. She lives in Castle Griffinheart. You can talk to her. She's a quest target also. Anyway, hey the prelate. Yeah, you're the one that's four point on self. I remember now. You are a peasant. Welcome to the capital of Stedwick. Where are the griffins? Yep, this is where you can make stuff. I think making items probably makes the most sense. Okay, I've used up all my ore. Ah, so powerful. That's actually a useful item. That's kind of garbage. That's cell bait. That's technically not worthless because I haven't actually equipped cloaks on everybody yet. Hmm. That's garbage. This is worthless. That's not. So, basically, if you have two items of the same attribute, they don't stack. You just take whichever one's higher. So, in this case, I would get stealing plus eight, as opposed to the stealing plus six over here, or stealing plus three over here. So, I'm actually going to swap to unenchanted gauntlets, because I can. So, this one's armor. You're a monk. And that one's weapons. And that's really about it for Stedwick. There's another town in this area that I'm going to go. Oh, here we go. That was one of the ones I needed. It's a breed of Medusa infesting the red dwarf mines that's immune to magic. These monsters give her a real terror. I can only thank the gods that these creatures haven't escaped the mine. What would we do then? Beat them, so beat them to death with our staves? So, yeah, um, the creature that's immune to magic are Medusas in the Red Dwarf Mines, which, yes, we're going to have to go after them early in the game. Yeah, that's just refreshing. Um, and the creatures that are immune to magic, if you couldn't figure or immune to physical, if you couldn't figure it out, are oozes. Because, of course, they are. So that's the reason why I'm kind of delaying going into the Red Dwarf Mines. You also need to go into the Red Dwarf Mines for another Barrow Downs quest. So we're going to move on a little bit further. It's 1 o'clock now, but I've got a couple more things I want to do. Like, go grab the Thief Promotion quest, in which you have to go to the sewers for. Got a bunch of robbers there. And the sewer entrance is right here. Ow! What a Oops. I don't care if they're coming or not. Robbers are not difficult. Yeah, they're 30 hit point wonders. Okay. 
run in loot their bodies, which will attract more of them, I know. And run back. Kill more. Rinse, repeat. Like I said, these are not difficult enemies. I'm not too concerned. That was too easy. No problem. Especially when they get stuck on the water like this. Anyway, I'm going to stop right when I... Ah, oh, it's running away. There we go. I'm going to stop once I finish looting these and killing these enemies. Because where I actually want to go is the sewers. Ow. Oh, that was easy. There we go. And we're going to stop right here. Is this episode 06 or is this episode 05? Uh, I should probably know the answer to that. Hold on a moment. Um, this is 05. Okay. So let's save over 05. Yeah. That was still this episode. Okay. All right, and we're going to go ahead and stop it here. Hope you've enjoyed this video, and I will start back again going through the sewers of Freehaven. I mean, um, uh, Stedwick. Yeah, yeah, Stedwick. That, that, that's where we're at. Yeah. Bye!